Let's go to the example application that's included, Demo Ray Tracer. Click on that, choose Run. We have the application up. I'm going to choose Render. It's finished rendering, so I want to choose Terminate and get a snapshot. We have four different threads here. We're not really sure which thread we want to look in. I'm going to go into the first thread. I see there's a program main. I can start digging into here and it can get pretty confusing very quickly. What am I looking for? I'm really looking for hotspots or maybe methods that have a large ownership time. So I'm going to go to the method list, choose own time. And I don't really care about the .NET Framework stuff, the where enumerable iterator or the where select array iterator. I care about the ray tracing namespace. So I see ray tracing.sphere.intersect is being held on to 2.66% of the time. So I can right click this and choose navigate to call tree. Now we're back to the call tree. At the top of the screen we have the call tree navigator panel open. Down here we have the first instance selected, ray tracing.sphere.intersect. If you go up to the call tree to see how it's being called. I can choose the VCR buttons right here to navigate through it and find more places this method is being called. And if I no longer want this up, I can choose this button right here. In fact, if I already know the method that I'm looking for, say I care about vector.minus, I can open this up myself and choose ray tracing and we have auto completion here dot vector dot minus and we can navigate these as well